Hey, hi friends and welcome back to my channel. My name is Shivangi Tiwari and I create videos related to career inspiration and lifestyle and if that's what you are searching for, then you have landed at the right place. In today's video, let's discuss the difference between ChatGPT, Bing and Bard and see that which one will be most useful for you in today's time. Let's quickly know what are these tools and why are they used for. So ChatGPT, Bing and Bard, all these tools have been developed to help us interact with the technology in a more intuitive and natural way. ChatGPT is a language model developed by OpenAI that uses deep learning techniques to generate human-like responses to natural language input. Bing is a search engine developed by Microsoft that provides users with relevant and useful search results. Bard is a conventional AI platform that uses natural language processing to help businesses automate customer support and other tasks. Since all of them have unique features and use cases, let's know which one will be most useful for us. So for reference, I checked the usage of ChatGPT. So in order to interact with ChatGPT, since it is a chatbot and it gives responses like humans, you have to type in your query or your prompts or your instructions or your commands to get the desired output. So the better you give the questions, the better you get the answer. So I simply wrote that I'm not feeling well today. Can you write a motivational story for me? And it is writing a motivational story for me. So it you will feel like as if you are interacting to a human being who is giving you very smart and intelligent answers. Next, I went to search how we can use Bard. But unfortunately, Bard is currently not available in India. I searched this and I got this answer. But it's okay, when it, whenever it will be available, we can use it. Currently, US people are using it. So we can get the reference and we can understand how it works. But the main difference between Bing and Bard is that Bard is an AI-powered writing assistant that helps with content creation and optimization, while Bing is a search engine that provides users with search results and answers to their queries. So to search about it, I went to Bing and I searched the same question which I searched on ChatGPT. I typed the same, I'm feeling low today, can you please write a motivational story for me? And it landed me to a place where I could see so many search options available and I could actually pick up the one which I want to read based on the current and trending reads. So here are the different options which I got. There are so many links which I could open and search according to my own preference. So we can say that Bing is basically a search based model. It is integrated with Google search only and we can see the trending things available on Bing. As Bing is also famous for generating image from a text, I also tried that. So I generated an image of a dog eating ice cream and wearing a cap. So it was a creative image, but I actually found them on Bing, which was surprising for me and I really got good answers. So if you have to do a web search, image search, video search, news search or any map related search, then Bing is for you. Since all these language models have revolutionized the field of NLP, including ChatGPT or Bing or Google Bard, each of these models stands out in some way or the other depending on their own attributes and abilities. Although these are not the only NLP chatbots out there, but the surprising fact is ChatGPT has 6 billion training parameters and can generate human-like text and responses to any given prompt. And the best part about ChatGPT is it can understand your natural language and it can perform a wide range of tasks including language translation, question answer, summarizations and much more. Perhaps Bing is also similar but the major difference between ChatGPT and Bing is that Bing has access to the entirety of the internet while ChatGPT only has the access to the data it is trained with. So Bing can provide you with weather forecasts, news updates or anything which is trending on the internet and you will be able to search and get it. So this is the major difference between ChatGPT and Bing. Unlike other chatbots that rely on GPT-based technology, Google Bard uses a completely different technology powered by an extension of the in-house Lambda that the company previewed a couple of years ago at Google I.O. So some users have reported that Google Bard is less advanced than its competitors. I'll explain this to you with a simple example. So ChatGPT's training database includes materials like Wikipedia and Common Crawl. Whereas when it comes to Lambda, it was trained using more human dialogues. So the result is that the ChatGPT tends to use longer and more well-structured sentences, while Lambda has a more very casual style. So although Google is currently facing challenges in dealing with the bot's propensity to make factual errors and promote misinformation, 
the company is expected to improve its chatbot to compete with the growing competition from Microsoft and OpenAI. But considering the use cases of BART, so it is capable of performing tasks such as answering questions, summarizing any information and creating content when given any prompt. BARD has flexibility because it is connected to the internet as well as Google search database. So BARD can also help users explore different topics by summarizing information from the internet and providing links to relevant website for more in-depth information. So now coming back to our original question that out of chat, GPT, Bing and BARD, which one will be most useful for you? So ultimately the best platform for you will depend on the task you need to accomplish. If you need to generate natural language text or have a conversation, then ChatGPT might be a good choice for you. If you need to search the web for information, Bing or Google Bard might be more appropriate. So each platform has its own strengths and weaknesses and the best choice for you will depend on your specific needs and preferences. But since Bing and Bard are still in development phase, for now ChatGPT is the best option which we have. आपको आज का शॉर्ट वीडियो अच्छा लगा होगा सो so, अगर वीडियो अच्छा लगा है तो डोंट विद थम्स अप शेयर टू ऑल योर फ्रेंड्स एंड फैमिली सब्सक्राइब टू माय चैनल एंड डोंट फॉरगेट टू हिट द बेल आइकॉन सो दैट यू गेट नोटिफाइड एनी टाइम आई पोस्ट माय न्यू वीडियो थैंक यू सो मच